possessive pronouns. Pronouns take the place of nouns. Possessive pronouns take the place of names of someone or something and show possession. The boy shown in the picture is possessing a soccer ball, a soccer uniform, knee pads, and one pair of sport shoes. Possessive pronouns show that something belongs to someone or something. They can either come before or after the noun of possession. They make sentences shorter and easier to say. Here is a list of possessive pronouns. My, mine, her, hers, your, yours, our, ours, their, theirs, his, its, whose, ones. Notice that the possessive pronoun ones is the only possessive pronoun that uses an apostrophe to show possession. We usually use apostrophes whenever showing possession. For example, John's watch was very expensive. To show that the watch belongs to John, we use an apostrophe and s. However, when using possessive pronouns, you do not need to use apostrophes except for in the word ones. Usage of possessive pronouns in sentences. Read the conversations below to get an idea about how possessive pronouns are used. Here, each possessive pronoun is underlined. Is this my cup of water? No, I don't think so. Whose is it then? I think it is theirs. Oh, where is mine then? Yours is over there. Oh, okay. Rules for pronouns with gerunds. Gerunds are nouns that end in ing and function as a noun in the sentence. Because of their function, they might seem a bit confusing. Pronouns that come before gerunds are almost always possessive pronouns. Examples of possessive pronouns with gerunds. I did not like him making fun of the other student. Here, him is incorrect with the gerund making. I did not like his making fun of the other student. The word his is correct with the gerund making in this sentence. Me calling the dog caused him to jump up from the couch. Here, me is incorrect with the gerund calling. My calling the dog caused him to jump up from the couch. The word my is correct with the gerund calling. Them working late 
allowed them to finish on time. Here, the word them is incorrect, with the gerund working. Their working late allowed them to finish on time. The word there is correct, with the gerund working. Now read about each of the possessive pronouns. My My describes something that belongs to me. It must be followed by a noun. These are my rings. Here, my shows that the rings belong to the speaker. Mine Mine describes something that belongs to me. It takes the place of the noun it possesses. The keys are mine. Here, mine shows that the keys belong to the speaker. Your Your describes something that belongs to you. It must be followed by a noun. This is your shoe. Here, your shows that the shoe belongs to someone being spoken to. Yours Yours describes something that belongs to you. It takes the place of the noun it possesses. The car is yours. Here, yours shows that the car belongs to someone being spoken to. Our Our describes something that belongs to us. It must be followed by a noun. Our house is white. Here, our shows that the house belongs to more than one person. Ours Ours describes something that belongs to us. It takes the place of the noun it possesses. The money is ours. Here, Ours shows that the money belongs to more than one person. His His describes something that belongs to a male. It may or may not take the place of the noun it possesses. His pencil was not sharp. Here, his shows that the pencil belongs to a male person. Her Her describes something that belongs to a female. It must be followed by a noun. Her hair is brown. Here, her shows that the hair is that of a female. Hers Hers describes something that belongs to a female. It takes the place of the noun it possesses. This pen is hers. Here, hers shows that the pen belongs to a female. It's It's describes something that belongs to it. It must be followed by a noun. Here is its arm. Here, its shows that the arm belongs to something it is a part of. There. There describes something that belongs to them. It must be followed by a noun.
Where are their tickets? Here, there shows that the tickets belong to more than one person. Theirs. Theirs describes something that belongs to them. It takes the place of the noun it possesses. The cats are theirs. Here, theirs shows that the cats belong to more than one person. Whose Whose describes something that belongs to an unknown. It must be followed by a noun. Do you know whose dictionary this is? Here, whose shows that the person being spoken of is unknown. Ones. Ones describes something that belongs to any person. It must be followed by a noun. It is a good idea to save one's money. Here, one's shows that money belongs to any person and not to any specific one.